feel like the team grew up a lot from last year to this year. Um, have a lot more more veteran leadership with a lot more championship experience. Um, you know, one of the biggest keys is that they do a lot more things on their own without us having to ask. You know, so whether it be training over the summer, they came in in the fall in great shape. They did a great job of doing things on, on their own, and that shows a sign of them growing up and, and us actually starting to develop leaders. So. We, we have a lot, like, like Kevin said, we have a lot more people who have championship experience. So if you go back a year and a half, uh, I was very impressed with some of our men last year for talking about nationals uh, you know, six months before the meet. Uh, but a lot of those guys hadn't been there or hadn't been there as a real team before. And you know, now they're in a boat where they're talking about it uh, and have been talking about it, but they know what it's like and they've been there together. Uh, and, you know, we have new additions too, which is great, but uh, it, it, it's something that they've really been planning for. And, and the women too, you know, they're kind of in, in a similar boat to where the men were last year, talking about it and excited for what they can do. My eyes, I, I believe both teams have the potential to make the podium. Um, I think our women are going to shock a lot of people across the country. Um, they're a lot better than they even know they are. Um, and I think our men have gotten better. Um, and not so much that it's more talented, I think we've developed better leaders. So uh, they do things the right way now. So we have less of you know, the, the individual, uh, more so everybody's thinking along the lines of a team and what we need to do as a team and what can I do to make the team better. Um, and doing the right things on and off the track, you know, and it show with their grades this fall. You know, and I think when it's all said and done, we'll probably have our highest GPA ever. And they've you know, honestly committed to being, you know, great on and off the track, which is always a good thing to see. So. Yeah. And, and I'll say this, we have plenty of talent to be very good. Mm -hmm. And really the things Kevin's talking about, leadership and, and culture, continuing to develop those things, good things will happen on the track if, if they continue to do that. This year I feel like we're coming back with a bang. Um, Coach Kevin is really pushing us this offseason. I look around this team every day and I see so much talent and I'm just really excited for what we can do. I think we're going to have some pretty good openers this year in New York and hopefully just progress and get as many people as possible to Nationals. Yeah, I think it's a big difference with the atmosphere on the team. We are already focused and excited and it's great to have Coach Akil to join us, our team. He's a really good jump coach, and I think the jump squad is going to do really good, thanks to him. Yes, yeah, so this year, this cross-country season was uh, the best ever for the, the program, for the team. Uh, we had a great uh, time together, and we're looking forward to having a great time again with the, the track as well, and with new, new partners. We've been seeing each other many times this season at practice. Now we're looking forward to have like good meets. Last year was a great year for us. I mean, that's the, it's the highest we've achieved as a team in, I think, program history, both indoor and outdoor. So um, our goal was to, to win a national title, but we fell short. And this year, we're not going to take any of that for granted. We're going to go ahead and uh, do the best we can to, to take the W. I mean, the talent we brought in this year is very beneficial to us because last year we had a lot of injuries, uh, but we didn't have a lot of depth, you know, for people to fill in those spots. And this year, I think with our training, uh, we have more so of people who can step up if one person goes down in one event. So it, it's been good this year. We have, um, so uh, Kevin and Tori are still here with very experiences. We're, they're like knowledge and it's good having them. And it's also good to have new coaching staff with uh, Jen, uh, especially for the distance, and Akil. They're both uh, very good coach for now. And, and I'm looking forward to learn a lot about about what they know and they help, they help us already. One thing I can say about Coach Kev is um, he coaches the athlete, not the event. So I really appreciate that. Um, he just helped me out with my mentality a lot this year. Um, and other than that, yeah, he's given us everything that we expect from him to give in more. And we all do feel stronger. Like everybody's in the best shape of their life and we're just trying to go out there and do something great this year. Two, three, nice! nice.